here are some of the corrections. So, the adjective that we mentioned for describing a room that's very uncomfortably small, there's not a lot of space in it, it's cramped. Cramped. And then an adjective for describing a room that's not really taken care of, a bit, you know, messy, it's shabby. Shabby. Kirofano? Operating room, operating room, or just OR, OR. Okay, then we're talking about the difference between downside and the disadvantage. So a downside would be a negative aspect of some situation, um, and a disadvantage would be like a weakness or a setback. Um, so, for example, we have two teams playing football. One of them has, uh, both of them have five players, and one player gets injured. So the team that now has four players, in this case, it's a disadvantage, right? It's a disadvantage. Um, and then, for example, moving to another city um, is great. You have new opportunities. Um, it's exciting but uh, you don't know anyone, you have to start from the scratch and that could be a downside, a downside of moving to a new city. Okay, he roto mi hombro, I broke my shoulder, I broke my shoulder, me he sacado el hombro, I dislocated my shoulder, I dislocated my shoulder. Uh, demasiados colores, too many colors. Too many colors. Uh, and for pronunciation, we had surgeon, surgeon, definitely, definitely. And for sound of the month, we had learn, learn, Serbia, Serbia, and your first birthday, your first birthday. All right.